Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a quick project polish update. Last time I added in three new polishes even though I didn't finish any. I just needed some space to play around and not only use the polishes that I wanted to finish. So for this update I actually have an empty and it is one of the small depend polishes as you may can tell by because it's finished. This was my focus polish for this month and I just really wanted it gone. I was tired of the silver color on my nails even though I loved this polish so much. It was a part of their metallic line as you can see there and the last update I was up to there. There isn't much product in these but they take forever to go through anyway. As I said I really really like this polish but I can't get it anymore so can't rebuy it if I wanted to. So that's done. I have not planned on adding in a polish because I wanted to focus on some of the other ones that I have in the project. That makes sense, right? It's a pretty polish. It's meant to finish stuff. So that is my third polish done for the year. So the last two I and focusing on finish for this project is the Depend nail polish in this red color. I really really like it and I have the smallest amount of progress. Um, I don't know if you can see it but it is the last line in the row. Of course it's where the product is. Makes sense. I used this once and even though I think I need more coats it makes sense for me if there were more progress but that isn't. I have used this once or twice but I can't mark any progress, I can't see any but I am still at that marking right there in the bottom. I love that nail polish so much and I'm going to do my toes again too soon so I'm going to apply the black one because I really like my toenails to be black. I haven't used this so I'm just going to show you guys. It is, <laughs> it is a small W7 polish in this fuchsia hot pink shade. Maybe I'm going to use it. I think I am going to call this my focus polish. I need to remark it, but it is still at the edge there. This is a small, small bottle, so I think I can go through that fairly fast. And it is a nice summer polish because it is warm again in Denmark. I know I have said that on and off, but that's Denmark. So the combo I have on my nails are these two. The base one is the Catrice Luxury Nude Satin Shine Nail Polish in the Light in Pure Light. So you can see my markings right here and I am at the bottom line there. And again it is what I have on underneath the shiny polish. I really like this combo. And the one I have on top is the Kiko Makeup Milano Nail Lacquer in... 221. I adore this polish but I really want to use it more so that's why I have these two in the project. So if I want to change it up for the more darker colors or the hot pink I can wear these. So that is what I am doing right now. I guess that is my update. It's not very exciting but I do have an empty so maybe it's exciting. I don't know. It's, it's a small bottle so to me it's not that exciting but one polish less in my collection. Let me just end it here before I ramble on too much because I do that a lot and I edit out a lot of ramble in my videos re recently. So if you like this video give it a like, subscribe down below if you haven't already. I would love for you to stay on this channel. It's so fun to chat with you guys in the comments. So if you have a comment or request or anything leave them down below and until my next video please take care.